The that Beast again! What a fight. Wow! Oh Big showing God. in Las Vegas, Manon Fioro. Manon Fioro has taken the women's flyweight division by storm and is already finding herself in the top 10 rankings at the number 7 spot. France has yet to have a homegrown UFC champion, and we think Fioro might just be the one to do it. Today we're taking a look at the UFC's rising star, Manon the Beast Fioro. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and check back every week for more Ultimate MMA. Fioro's start in combat sports began at the age of seven when she started karate. After taking a break to focus on snowboarding, Fioro became a black belt. Unfortunately, Fioro was selected for karate championships but had to bow out due to injury. During this time, Fioro discovered kickboxing and Muay Thai. Fioro's amateur record in Muay Thai is 12 victories and zero losses. Dana White had to take notice. Manon Fioro made her UFC debut on January 20th, 2021, when she faced Victoria Leonardo at UFC on ESPN. If she starts to throw the body kick, man, she will start to get the hands of Victoria being carried a little bit lower. And then I call her and finish her. That's a hard left hand there by There's a oh. check. See that check? That check That's right a beautiful ball. check right I mean, she's throwing. she just really steps out of range and sits on that right hand. Luke Rockhold used to throw a really good check right hook. Yes. From the southpaw position. Yep. Look. Oh. 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 oh, my goodness. Oh. Oh. Turn it on. Wow. She gets a win in her debut. What a fantastic performance by the Frenchman Manon the Beast Fioho. She won that matchup via a second round technical knockout. Fioro would keep up her winning streak when she faced Tabitha Ricci at UFC Fight Night and came out with another win by TKO. Oh, oh, big right God. sits her down. That is ah, the beginning of the end. Fioro hammering away. Ricci back to her feet. Hey, look at that. He's so strong. I'm telling you, it's a fury. So overwhelming. And the toughness of Ricci to stay in this right now. I mean, goodness. Could you imagine if she does something with this Kimura hold that she has here? No, no, no. Oh, 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 That's gonna do it! The Beast again! What a fight. Wow! Oh, Big showing God. in Las Vegas, Manon Fioro, the winning streak is at seven. Fioro then went on to face Myra Bueno Silva at UFC Fight Night and won the match via unanimous decision. You know, you want to say, you're not hurting me, you're not bothering me. It's all mind games. The first takedown attempt of the fight from Fjord. She gets it there pretty easily. 30 seconds to work on the ground. Now there's no smile on the block strikes now. There's all aggression and a scowl for Myra Bueno Silva. Manon Fjord still turning up the volume. In on the clinch. Bueno Silva, blood dripping from the lip, frustrated. Oh, dumped. Yeah, and that was with authority. Fioro scored another unanimous decision victory when she faced longtime fighter Jennifer Maya at UFC on ESPN. Big shot. And another side kick by Manon. Interesting. Oh, look at that. Beautiful hit throw. Beautiful wizard kick there by Manon Fioro. Um, yeah, she just yes. looked good. And still shows how viable she is at the top of this division. Manon Fior consistently uses that lead leg. I'd like to see the bad leg get thrown off, as you were saying before. Next up, Manon Fioro is set to face the number 10 fighter in the women's flyweight rankings, Caitlin Chukagian at UFC 280. We can't wait to see how long Fioro's winning streak can last. Do you think Manon Fioro has what it takes to become champion? Let us know in the comments. If you like this video, be sure to subscribe and check back every week for more Ultimate MMA.